This cartoon raises a great point. Will the West open its borders to the people of Sudan that are fleeing the conflict like they did for uh, the people of Ukraine? Will the West, will Europe, will the United States of America open their wallets and send hundreds of billions of dollars in aid for the people of Sudan? Kingdom, our first uh, and over overwhelming priority is to support British nationals out there in Sudan right now. Sure, but I think people will remember this time last year when you were trying to get British people uh, and rescue them from Ukraine. But you were also coming up with safe routes from Ukraine that uh, Ukrainian people could get to the UK. We remember the, the various programmes that were announced. Uh, would it be sensible, fair to do the same kind of thing for people from Sudan? Well, the situation is at a very different to Ukraine. Uh, so I wouldn't want to draw those comparisons. Uh, we're at a very uh, early stage of the situation emerging in Sudan, there are, it's a very fast moving and rapidly changing picture. Uh, we, you know, it, there are a lot of unknowns right now about what the longer term implications are uh, of this uh, uh, conflict that we're seeing there. Uh, we are always, uh, the, the Foreign Office, the our military, uh, Ministry of Defence, the Home Office, all led by the Prime Minister, have put together a wide ranging and extensive package of support focused at helping British nationals. That's our duty. That's our priority.